One of my favorite topics, pregnancy and nursing. As I've told you before, we're very, very privileged. My wife and I have six children, five born at home, 10 grandchildren. And I give the same advice to all my children as I do to my patients. Uh, what, is, what supplements do you take during uh, pregnancy? A good prenatal vitamin, and of course I'm prejudiced, I think ours is the best. Why is ours unique? Because our uh, prenatal vitamin not only has all the ingredients that are necessary for a good prenatal vitamin, but they have probiotics, those are the friendly bacteria, aids in absorption and potency, as well as 4,000 units of vitamin D3. But I recommend even more vitamin D3. For pregnant women, I recommend a minimum of 10,000 units of vitamin D3. And this has become very important, not only for pregnancy, but for nursing. The American Academy of Pediatrics has made the statement that breast milk contains no vitamin D. They're almost right because most pregnant women and most nursing women don't get enough vitamin D, either through direct sunlight exposure or by taking supplementation. The studies by Dr. Cedric Garland have shown that if pregnant women and nursing mothers get enough vitamin D, the breast milk is loaded with vitamin D. So it is imperative by him, one of the world's experts on vitamin D for pregnancy and, and nursing to take a minimum of 10,000 units of vitamin D3 a day. Now, how do you know you have enough? Measure, get your vitamin D level checked. Once again, 60 nanograms per ml, that's the magic number. Let me recap again, for pregnancy and nursing, prenatal vitamin with uh, probiotics, number two, omega-3 fatty acids, and enough vitamin D, at least 10,000, to raise your level above 60 nanograms per ml.